What's going on, Tiger Tran clan? Finally, our guys, they're mining over here. Miracles can happen if you just believe. <laughs> they're all on nine priority jobs, so I'm hoping that they will get that LG. Oh, good. Yes, oxygen production in here. Yay. I have the door open. I created this vent because I was like, gosh, we just need to get some of this oxygen coming into the base. And to be honest, it's not as hot over here as it is over here. And probably because we've got tons of things going on. But we, you know, we're continuing to make that delicious food. We've got tons of wheat probably still. I don't know how much wheat we have. Let's go edibles. So we still got a ton of loaf. They actually love this berry sludge. Wow, we've got a ton of frost buns, tons of fried mushrooms still, meat. Yeah, oh my gosh, we have so much mushrooms. Isn't that what this cooks? Is uh, mushrooms, yeah. So food I don't think will be an issue. Thankfully, finally, we're starting to get, ah, uh, pressure. Under pressure. All right, so thankfully the skimmer, so everything's coming down, I think. I think the pressure will start to rise, so thankfully these will start to grow again not, not too long from now. Natural gas, I definitely need to pump out at some time soon. But now I, the most important job is they're getting in here. As soon as they dig through here, man, this will be glorious for us because then we can get a boat with the LG. This is going to be fantastic. But we've got fertilizer. I, I almost feel like, do we make more of these distilleries? I don't know. I feel like, to be honest, slime, we eat through it really fast. I mean, we eat through algae fast as well. But I really want to change this into a... What are they called? One of these rooms. So I'm thinking if I just set up... Because we have pipes here already. At least that we will. That'll be a build job for the epic future, that's for sure. The starvation thing is very strange to me. Hey, how you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. I'm gonna go breathe some polluted oxygen. <laughs> yeah, alright, so... How much LG really is this? 123, what does that mean? Is that kilograms? It must be kilograms. Alright, let's look real quick. Two, looks like two of them stacked, so yeah, it is kilograms. Because I wonder, and I guess this is why algae is never a long term solution for oxygen, right? It's because these things probably just eat that up. So, does anywhere tell you how much it consumes? It doesn't. Not a huge deal. Thankfully, our Weezwar, hopefully, you guys keep it nice and chile in here. But it looks like now as the pressure is slowly coming up, it's soaking up all of that low pressure and cooling it really quickly. So that way as more gas is coming down here, I think it'll hopefully keep this place nice and chilly. And this is good because this is pumping out hotter oxygen, so hopefully it's just that cools and everything before it comes over here. But I think this is working. It's inevitably, inevitably we have got back online. It's just so, like this game, I love this game, but man, there's just so many, this is even, it's just so easy for people to die in this game or something to go nuclear. I think that's one thing I find very interesting about it. Well, you probably pump water in here and this might be Bristleberry in the future, but now that I think about it, because you just need water. But when we need more food production in the future, that's what we'll do. Thankfully, they're getting the algae, they're making it here as well. Jobs are looking good. We don't have energy for this, which is surprising because this is a nine job, but I don't know why they don't prioritize this. Oh, okay, good. So this area just got done too, so let's go ahead and set up that station. Exosutforge. And then let's get some high level power and move into this bad boy. We need power! Do it now! And we're... Eh, 
We'll sub priority eight this. Because it is important. That's not important, so we cancel this. What's breaking here? Or maybe it's just been broken and repair jobs are not priorities in our lands at all. Oh, there we go. We'll lock starting to mine some random stuff here. Oh yeah, we were gonna take this oxygen. Not this oxygen. We were gonna take this uh, water and start having it start to get come down. Oh, I started to think about it. We should dig this out. It's hot. Get out of here, man. Oh no, daddy. Why are you going that way? Quickly! Mine quickly! We don't want the water to come this way! Though it doesn't really matter, to be honest. I mean, it's not ideal. Alright, good. Now it's starting. It's, it's going, it's going. A little bit of a pool over here. I don't think we'll that to deal. You're like, it's so hot, man. Why are you pooling, boiling water onto my face? Is this water boiling though? Oh, it's 136 degrees. I. But this will create steam forever and will once again help us with our water supply, which I'm all about. I wonder, will this water become polluted at some point? I, I don't know exactly how that all works. I mean, I know we're pumping polluted water into it. So I think with this one here, let's go ahead and disable this building. Mostly because we don't need oxygen being pumped here because this vent's already overflowing or maxed. But we do need it down here. Yay! Oxygen is coming back. Life is happening. To so many a build job. And thankfully we're building up our, our slime reserves and our basically all of our reserves of uh, LG. So this is this is good for us. Very, very, very good for us. And, you know, in the real life, you can grow LG. I mean, it is biomatter. I'm surprised there isn't, like, LG farms. I don't know what you would need. I mean, what? What? I mean, LG just grows, like, on anything. I think it just needs water. It's like, give me a rock. You know what I mean? How are you guys sad about eating these delicious buns? Kill me, smalls. I just love watching them all run around. I do wish that they're... And maybe... I wonder if anyone's created mods to make them more efficient. And their ability to run around and not be as dopey as they are at times. Okay. I think once this system gets online too... Oh, it's gonna be so nice. Definitely will be a while though, I think. Because we've got a lot of high priority build jobs with the ladders over here, especially. It's so interesting how water works in this game. See how it's like clumping here instead of just like going in over here? I just find that so strange. But this will be a good place for a pump. Inevitably, I don't know what we'll do. Pump, because I'm thinking, like, where do we want the natural gas to go, right? That's why I'm wondering if we just have everything pump up into... So, okay, so let's say we pumped everything into here, up top. So let's say this pumps, this always... So always natural gas will get... It's always going to pump the carbon here. 
the skimmer could always clear the, the carbon out, or the, excuse me, the carbon dioxide out. So maybe that's the system, right? And then it just gets, we put weird gases in here, because most of the, most of this stuff is completely fine. Looks like we can't. Looks like they, we can't reach this though, so let's pop up here. I think it's all these LG jobs, all these LG slime jobs, since they're all, well, a lot of them we put on is nine. This is why they're not prioritizing those build jobs over here. Please, sirs. Yeah, look at all that steamy deliciousness. Give me all that water. You know, which would be interesting. What if we put hot water into here for the plants? Do you think it would cool down the the water and the, the plants would... Or I guess it would... The, because they're, they're absorbing the water, right? So uh, the plants would probably be hot, but would that be a good way of cooling down water? That is inevitably kind of going into the base, but indirectly. I'm not sure. Wow, we've got 14k dirt. That'll be good, too, if we ever have a massive food shortage at some point in the future. I'm actually pretty pumped about that. Because when you get to those points, you're like, slime. Or not slime. What is it? Lice weed? No, it's the mush. It's that terrible mush that you can make. Mush bars that give you diarrhea. Ugh. But this will be nice. So soon we'll be able to make exosuits, which will be fantastic. Then we can start putting these areas to use, which will also be fantastic. Because we're putting a checkpoint right here. And then I think we'll do the same over here. We will need to set up another set of bathrooms. I don't know where that's going to be. Actually, this might be a good spot for it. Yeah, because it's close to everything over here. It's actually, maybe we do it right now. Just a couple of them. Doesn't need to be a super crazy high priority. Where are you? Says. Okay, good. She's getting back. What were you doing up here? Under pressure. Oh, they're mopping. That's what it is. And now we know later in the future. I mean, obviously, we just needed powers like ASAP. So what's cool is like we could in the future build these bad boys like over here. So that way it would just drip all that polluted water directly in here. But to be honest, this isn't that big of a deal. And it's nice that we have this like stopping point here as well. So we'll just put this as like a low level job. Five is free. Ironically, five is low level, even though this is the baseline. There's just so many priorities in the world. Oxygen producing, food creation, cleaning toilets, feeding the little beasts, which is probably one of the highest. Where's our little... Our smooth hatch is still down here. I don't know if he's eating anything. This needs to be like priority yesterday. Oh no, damn it. Smooth hatch and hatchlings, please go quickly. So not for hatch, not for sage. Shovel bowl? These are new. Wait, what the heck happened to this one? We gotta swear. 
Because smooth hatches, these guys actually eat the metals. And I think we wanted to feed them. Wolframite. Because you little baby ones eat the same thing, right? Tell me that you're going to take him up here. Oh, he is. Well, he, he almost did. <laughs> Are you guys cramped in here? Yay, you're doing well. That's nice. And inevitably, we will build another grouping over here. Where is it, though? Crit says, I'm assuming you're in food. station as well as it's a taking care of station <laughs> taking care of business you know, working all the time work out so that must be a station oh dang it I put him on his nine jobs didn't I that's all good to be honest, they're laying eggs like at an incredible rate. So where's a hot place that'd be good for eggs? Like this part. It's 100 degrees. I feel like if we just even just put eggs over here, they would hatch at the speed of Zeus. Oh my gosh, Mima. I feel your pain, man. That's a lot of polluted water building up over here. But it is an important job. Because if it, I think if this gets so covered that I think it would not function anymore. There's a part of me... Oh... Well, what was I thinking? Was I trying to get up into here, probably? Or no, I was trying to get all this coal. Unreachable dig site. No, it's not. Liars! It's 100% reachable. She's like, stand here and shoot at an angle. Oh, it is unreachable. They must have mined out what's over down here. Okay, okay, you got me. I'm the monkeys. Oh yeah, we wanted to get up in there so we can get that lice as well. Not lice. I'm just calling everything lice. There we go. So we can get this wheat. Is there another plant over here? Oh, it is. Okay. What is this ladder? I wonder if there's anything behind here. Seems, seems like there is. Go ahead and we'll build this ladder. This is not as high a priority, so we'll bomb this thing here for now. And then we can also be here. So I'm kind of interested to know what's up in here. Our base is doing fantastic. I love it. Got enough carbon down here to keep this growing well. This ooh, body temperature. So body temperature is the issue, it looks like. But also, I wonder... I mean, the Wii Sports are... They're going. They're popping off. I'm hoping that's enough. Oxygen is real thick. Inevitably, they'll get to these insulated pipe jobs soon. Really, no water. That is surprising. I feel like we have boatloads of water. Oh, it's just coming in at a pretty slow pace, it looks like. stuff is so interesting. I love watching it. Oh, this is probably just needs some materials pumped into it so we can start making fertilizer. I just think this is just all so cool, man. 
just seeing how this stuff all works. I wonder if this machine gets busted up at all by using when it gets, um, I think it needs polluted water, but what happens when the clean water goes in? I think they're doing major work over here. Where's the priorities? Seven. Don't trap yourself, Auto. Fill with despair. these airlocks though oh wow look at our food supplies they're skyrocketing yay exosuits suit Ooh, a jet suit okay so you need steel and you need petroleum i don't think we have steel i don't know how to make steel now that i think about it allows flight supplies duplicates with oxygen and toxic breathing environments oh i want it but i have to figure out how to make steel i think it's just because it's let's create oh you just need copper ore Oh my gosh, it gives you plus 10 to digging? What makes you slow? Interesting. Okay. Alright, well this is important, so let's go ahead and we'll drop this to an 8. And... Because I really want it over here, because we can really protect ourselves from death and despair. Alright, let's go ahead and start planning about how we're going to do it. First we gotta first we gotta make sure we just have toilets. So let's go plumbing first. Outhouses. Where's the little sinks? Oh, did we ever unlock the hygienic stations? Because those would be nice. Is it a utility? I would feel like it'd be under medical. Yeah, hand sanitizer. So you need raw metal and bleach stone. Oh, we still found bleach stone? But there's like a boatload of bleach stone in these biomes. It's like these white stones right here. Okay, so I guess we could just stick with the sinks. Wash basins. We probably only need one, because we're not going to put too many toilets over here. Mr. Toilets, where are you now? my wife she's, so today's my birthday and she's making my my favorite dish which is ribs ribs mashed potatoes and she said normally cornbread but i think she's swapping something out instead of the cornbread so she said get ready it's gonna be good so it's like all right no why do you need 60 to be so tall i feel like paintings are in the background you should be able to just put something over just saying, guys. Just saying. Alright, I've been looking for bathrooms forever. Plumbing. It's plumbing. Why don't I just look? If I put this here, it's gonna take it get rid of that. So we'll just put this here for now. I know you get a morale bonus, but ugh, I just can't justify it, man. So this got the illumination from this guy. If you ever make light... cranking out vitamins still oh they are good i i had put this as a high priority job so hopefully this would help with uh, all the sickness we'll take this off once we okay good like, what are you doing over here man are you just like picking up wheat I mean, now I don't want to take the weed out, but you know, in reality, well, I guess it helps our cooks. I was gonna say, we probably don't even need to put, because the wheat would just stay cold in their biomes, but then they would have to run across the universe 
to come and get it. But then I was thinking maybe if we only put sleep we eat one of these, like like this one here, and then once it gets full, it's just like nope, you don't put any more in there. I might have, might have some levels of efficiency. But man, we've got a lot of we're doing great from a food perspective. Cooking ingredients. So we're low on fertilizer, which is surprising to me, because all you need is phosphates and dirt. Phosphates. There we go. Wait. Really? Even though this is an A job, they're still like... Nah, dude, it's A job. I want to know, like, what causes this thing to shut down? Is it the lack of power, or is it the lack of water? The lack of oxygen? <laughs> now we're Schmott, obviously. Hello, Schmott. Let's follow you around. Because I'm kind of interested. What do you do now? After you've made metals for a little bit. Oh my gosh. You run all the way across the universe to do what? To pick up a lily flower? And then where are you bringing this lily flower? Into the station. Okay. And then now you're running all the way back up here to pick up some algae, which is, not, that's important. I think you're going to help us make oxygen. Wait, you just ate a grizzly meal? Why? Why would you just randomly eat meat? But maybe your expectations are low. Maybe they're smart enough that they eat things in alignment with their expectations, because that would be pretty dope. This is good too. Reduce your stress a little bit. You deserve it. You've been working hard. Now you run over here. Pick up some lice. Then what do you do with it? You eat it. Okay. <laughs> Why are you mad, man? You ain't scared. So now you run over here. Now what are you doing? Picking up coal. Cole's always that's an important job. I can respect that. Something just dropped. I don't know what that was. I think it was coal. So now you're running over here with coal in your inventory. Pick up a mushroom. Take a breather. I get it. There's carbon down there. Now where are you going? Wait, you just picked up a shroom. Maybe can you keep like one food item in your inventory? But you you picked up charcoal as well. Do you have like a certain size backpack? All right, let's. I wonder if we can see... No, he's not carrying anything. So you went, you picked up coal, you dropped the coal as soon as you came through the door, which makes no sense to me. And then you went and picked up a mushroom, and then you went and you breathed, and then you did... Then I guess you dropped the mushroom as well? That is confusing. That is very, very confusing. Okay. See, the thing I wonder is, is like, I wonder if these stations, when they're next to each other, if they have to be on, like, level ground. So I'm wondering if this room, if I need to just kind of, like, if I have to, like, raise it up, if that makes sense to you. Because we, we need this to be here, right? So we keep the water in? So I think we do. I don't think there's any poop. Well, there is. The reason we have this here is because there is polluted things that come out of here, but it's because of this room. So I think we might be able to destroy this as well. But let's... Hey, turd. No one's dead here. Get out of here. Let's not fart up the air. I'm still surprised none of these pipes have been built. Okay, so this will slowly fill up with water. I feel like, to be honest, we're, we're, I feel like we're doing good. So let's go ahead and deconstruct this, and we're going to start trying to make it so people aren't getting sick. I do not like having sick people in our base. That means we get rid of this as well. Which means that, to be honest, I think we have to deconstruct these also. Paintings that never got built. All right, 
right, so I think from here, I think we just have to set up a door. And the purpose of that door is to basically be where we start setting up the rest of this. From a checkpoint standpoint. for now. Dude, we totally need more builders. We've got oxygen, we've got food. So let's actually see if we can grab another builder. Supplier. Ooh, builder. Creative. Man, they got all this person has some great skills. Let's go ahead. Ada. Ada, my delicious builder. Go forth and be fantastic. We got a lot of builders, man. May as well. All right. So where is Ada? You'll be at the bottom because we just got you. So I need you to build like you've never built before. So I'm an architect, which is also a builder. So all right, perfect. Because if we can get ladders, that'll make it so our diggers can dig effectively. If we can get the infrastructure set up for cooling down our base, it'll be great for our long-term food solution, but just long-term base solution in general. And then... Yeah, because I'm trying to think, do we, where do we build more uh, oxalizers? And we could, we could actually do here, now that I think about it. Because this is a pretty solid power supply here. So if we could build some oxalizers like down here, let it get cooled, and the same thing, it'll inevitably pump that delicious oxygen, you know, back out. I guess it's probably dangerous. We might want to actually put the oxalizers like maybe like here, so the hydrogen could go up and start to pool. Or maybe even up here, right? So then it just maybe, yeah, maybe the oxalizers go like here. That would actually be really good. There's this way of building rooms where it's just basically. Like a self-powering room that's like self-sustained and self-regulating from a hydrogen perspective. And I kind of want to just maybe build like two of them over here. I don't know. And maybe even a hydrogen generator. Because it's like you put out, use it with a hydrogen generator as well. I don't know why I made that an A job. That is not necessary. How's our power generators doing? Pretty dang good. That's awesome, man. Because we haven't been using any coal over here. Just just the hydrogen that's being made from the oxalizers and then the natural gas. This is fantastic. Yeah, we're up to 21 point or 25.1 tons of coal. This is awesome, man. Water's getting poured in here as well. Hopefully getting polluted. <laughs> so we can continue just to make everything we need. This is fantastic. Alright guys, this has been Tiger Tran, and I'll see you guys next time.